Starting with exercise 1, let's add on and create exercise 2. The first thing we should do is go to File and Save As and give the name Exercise 2 to the current file so that we don't change anything in the completed Exercise 1. We can save this and now we will be editing a different file. In Exercise 2, we've added a number of fields to the already existing rooms and we've added an additional gymnasium and an auditorium. So, just going in the order of things listed, let's start by editing the general room additional information. We go to Create Templates, and we're going to enter the drift points, a cooling drift point of 81 and a heating drift point of 64, is done on the default as well as the general template. As mentioned, we'll have to change the schedules from design schedules to analysis schedules. So if we go to internal loads, select the classroom template, we need to change the internal load schedules for people, lighting, and miscellaneous loads. For people, we're going to select people, elementary school, plus summer. For lighting, we're going to select lights, elementary classroom. And for miscellaneous loads, we're going to do the same. Miscellaneous elementary school. The final thing we're going to do on this tab is select the energy meter. We'll set this to electricity. Now, we also need to make these changes on the hallway and office templates, which we'll do now. We'll fast forward through this part. So for the hallway, we select People Elementary Classroom plus Summer. For Lights, Lights Elementary Classroom. And Miscellaneous Loads, Miscellaneous Elementary School. And Electricity for the Energy Meter. We have done the same thing for Office, as you can see when we change the template. After making those changes, we have to create some new templates in order to accommodate the gymnasium and the auditorium. We'll start by creating the new internal load template. Since it is pretty similar to the Office template, we'll copy the Office template give it a new name, change the people density to 115 square foot per person, and change the schedule to people elementary gym. For the lighting type, in this case we're changing it to 50% of the load to the space, and 1 watt per square foot. The schedule is also going to change to lights elementary gymnasium. 